What up YouTube, it's your boy DZ90. Uh, today I have a new review for you. It's the Yeti Rambler 5000, I'm not kidding. Yeti Rambler 36 ounce bottle. Now, if you've seen my last video, um, you've seen that I get, this is the same color as my Yeti cooler, the Yeti 45. I just wanted to get it, you know, just to match with it actually. So here it is. I just got it in the mail today, so this is what you're, uh, what you'll be expecting. So it's, uh, it's a, it's a really good size, you know, for people who want to work and have your drink in here, whether it's soda, water, juice, whatever it is. So this is a little facts it has or, or scripting it has. The good thing about it is that it won't sweat, so I hate that with drinks when that happens. I think this is a, a version better than the Hydro Flask. Well, at least the color, you know. I haven't tried it out, so I can't say about the performance on it, but uh, I'm assuming it's good. But uh, I like the handle here on it. Really big. You can fit your fingers here. I have fat fingers, so I'm assuming for a person with smaller hands and skinny fingers, good grip on it. And as you can tell here, let me see the price. $49.99, 50 bucks. So I was lucky enough to get a $10 discount at Dick's Sporting Goods. So if you sign up for the reward points, you get $10 to use towards your purchase. So I would recommend to do that. $10 off is not bad, but I think this is a really good size and I like it a lot because, you know, it has a little nice clean uh, opening right here for you to drink. Let me take this off, a little plastic off. It's a chug cap is what they call it. Nice and clear here. And I come for see what's inside. So let's open this up. And like a rubber seal here. And I like the feel to this. See, it looks really clean and it's heavy. So <clears throat> to me, you know. It would seem that it's made out of good material, like a hard, a good hard plastic. But it looks nice, it looks fancy. Set that down, and this is a good deciding factor. This is what I wanted, wanted to, why I wanted to get it because you can put ice in it from a ice machine. You know, I'm not sure if you've seen the other other um, water bottles or. Ramblers where they're the opening is uh, narrow And it's hard to get ice in there over here. I can you can you can just see there scoop it up from uh, a Cooler or just put it in the ice ice machine don't have to worry about it spilling all over or catching it And yep fill it up with ice. Let's see what's inside here. Got some little goodies here, some information. So they have the 18, 36, and 64. So this is in the middle. 18, I guess it's it's good. I mean, it's good if you're gonna be carrying it for a long time. I imagine you don't want to get tired from it. 36, you know, you if it's a hot day, at least you're guaranteed to have a good amount of water in it. 64. I mean, I would assume it's you know for people who work in construction. Those people would need it, for sure. Okay, key features here: durable wall vacuum ins insulation keeps drinks cold or hot to the last drop. Yeah, I don't, I don't think I'm going to be keeping hot things in there, but you could also keep uh, use it for that. No sweat. One of the things I really like. Let's see what else. Of course, you want to wash it before you use it. 
dishwasher safe. Hmm. Um, I guess, I mean, I'm not, I don't really use the dishwasher, but I guess you could put it on there. Do not place a microwave, obviously. And other information here. And just, you know, just useful information, something to look at. I think they have a sticker here. Now they promote their other products here. Blah, blah, blah. They have a cool little sticker right here. You can put it on your back window or, or you can decorate it too, I guess. Put it on here. The only other thing that worries me is I assume it's going to, uh, people just take it hiking, take it to the gym. And it's not something you really care about to protect, you know. You just probably, if you take it hiking, you're probably going to want to set it down if you're being tired, carelessly, or, you know, ding it on the wall or something, you know, on a rock. Um, I'm just hoping it doesn't ding easy, but it appears that the, with the coating on here, it's, it's pretty thick. Uh, you can kind of feel like a groove here, like a, because of the like, double layer of paint, I guess. But yeah, you can definitely, definitely feel the groove. And it's a, it feels like a thick coat on here. So I'm hoping mine doesn't ding and the paint scratches off. I remember I had a not I had a knockoff hydro flask uh, maybe last year and that one was really beat up and dented. I'm hoping this steel on this is a little bit stronger and harder harder to dent. But yeah, for fifty bucks, I'm gonna be real careful with this. So uh, maybe if uh, after I use it, I'm, I'll try to make a video. Maybe after a month, see how it holds up. Uh, but again, again, this is a quick review. Just wanted to show what I have got in the mail. Uh, thanks again, YouTube, for watching. And I'll try to have some more interesting things to review as they come along. Um, again, they're going to be random. It's just things that I have interest in, things that are ex maybe expensive, and maybe things that uh, are trending. But uh, again, thank you, YouTube, for watching. Please like and subscribe. Take it easy.